Hello everyone, it's Shane Kanto, your Wasteland reviewer, and I'm here to review Good Grief. And this is the uh, directorial debut of Dan Levy, who also wrote and stars in this film, this drama, this comedy, this romance that focuses on Levy's character Mark, whose husband, played by Luke Evans, dies at the beginning of the film. Luke Evans is fantastic in the brief amount of time that he's in this film. Like, we're devastated to see him go from the film so early. But Levy finds out that his husband had this apartment in Paris, and he winds up going there to do some soul-searching and invites his friend Sophie, played by Ruth Nega, and Thomas, played by Himesh Patel, to tag along. And they go through processing grief and love and complex feelings about their futures and where their lives are taking them. And I think Levy brings a very authentic and rich and cool feel to the direction of this film. I think cinematographer Old Brat Berkland, yep, you heard that right, I think does a really fine job of making this feel like this modern kind of feeling film that captures the beauty of Paris and London, and we really appreciate where we're at at any given time. I think Levy is fantastic. He really pops with his own dialogue that he write, wrote for the film. And I think Mark's an interesting character who's processing through the really complex feelings. I think his friends Sophie and Thomas are both interesting characters, and Ruth Nega is killing it. She is fantastic and extremely charismatic. I think Patel does a fine job, too. The issue is I feel like some of these characters are so weaving so all over the place with their motivations, and sometimes it muddles the story and makes it overly complicated or tries to overly simplify things for conflict. I think there's some times where the film kind of wanders a bit or trying to do a little too much. But in general, this is an engaging and f a just rich feeling kind of film with some great performances. You have David Bradley, who plays Luke Evans' father, who is wonderful in the few scenes that he's in. This film has a rich thematic base to it and it has some very thoughtful ideas and perspectives on love and grief and processing those things. These are all complicated people, the three characters that we follow to Paris, but they're so interesting and engaging that we just want to be there and hopefully watch them figure out what to do with their lives and process the things that they're going through. This film is an entertaining an engaging and thoughtful film with some great performances and a lot of great potential from Levy as a writer-director. And of course, his performing is great as always. These actors really know how to grab the audience and take us on this journey with them. And I'm very happy that I got a chance to. I really enjoyed this film quite a bit. And it's right there on Netflix. So go ahead and enjoy it. You'll probably feel some things too. There's some... Especially the early scene of like the Christmas party, like it has a great opening sequence that has so many great highs and some rich lows in terms of emotions, but this film really does quite a few things that are really impressive. But those are my thoughts on Good Grief. Let me know what you think. Let's talk some movies. But thank you as always for tuning in and supporting your Wasteland Reviewer.